Right outside of Columbia, Tennessee, there's a really cool old bridge. Here is a picture of me standing on a rock in the middle of a creek. Here's another picture of that same creek, just from a different direction. I think that this is a really pretty creek. Here is yet another picture of it. It's pretty cool looking. Right across from the creek is this cool old barn with this also really cool old wall. An interesting thing about these walls is that when the farmers would plow the fields, these rocks would come up from their plowing and then they would just go ahead and build walls out of them. Now this picture is the, the rock that is underground that the farmers would end up accidentally pulling out of the ground. Very impressive that all of this rock is lying just right underneath of your feet. And also a cool thing is that lots of these old buildings you see that are almost 100 years old in some cases are still really structurally sound because they're sitting on this very solid rock foundation. This here is a slightly, well actually not really slightly, it's a very out of focus video of a beautiful country road. The video is out of focus because the camera was focusing on reflections in the windshield, but hopefully you can get an idea of just how pretty these country back roads really are. Here is a picture of two old log cabins that are sitting right next to the road. And here is a perfect example of how solid the, um, the rock underground is. These buildings are who knows how old but they still look like they could possibly be very, very solid. We have found a guy who makes what I believe are called coplas, and you put them on top of your barn, and they have a little weather vane on top to show you where the wind's going. It's kind of cool. He has all different kinds. In Tennessee, it rains about three inches in both the summer and the winter time. But isn't that what we really need anyways? <laughs>